You can go back and manage your playlist by clicking on your icon at the top right hand corner of the screen and choosing from the drop down list Video Manager. Once in the Video Manager, go to the left side and click on the Playlist button. There you'll see a list of all the playlists that you've created. And as you can see, it tells you how many movies are in all of them. Here's my movie, tr movie trailers playlist as well as my Diary of a Wimpy Kid trailer. I'm going to click on Edit. Uh, I'm going to click on Edit to edit my movie trailers playlist. And you can see I've got three movies in there. Some of the things that you can do while you're in the edit mode is you can change the title. So I'll have movie trailers and I'll just say these are various movies. I can uh, give a description as I've got here. I can change it from a public playlist to a private playlist. And I can also change these settings. Allow others to embed this playlist. Sure, I will allow that. Or allow others to like or dislike this playlist. Eh, I'm feeling a little bit uh, uh, thin-skinned today, so I'm going to uncheck that so that people won't give me any negative feedback. You can change the order of the videos by clicking and dragging the videos into any order, like so. You can edit the note in here by double-clicking or by clicking on Add a Note. I can edit that note. Click on Add a Note and I can edit. If I want to delete a video, and since I've got a, a, a separate playlist for Wimpy Kid movie trailers, I don't need it on this m playlist either. So to delete it, I'll just check this box. I'll go up to the Actions and choose Remove Videos from Playlist. This video will be removed once I save my changes to the playlist. If I decide, bef before I hit Save, if I decide to change my mind, I just click Undo and it comes back. So I'll check it again. Go to Actions, Remove from Playlist, and then I'm going to click on Save. And that's, and that's basically how you manage your video playlist.